Here we are on a SharePoint site that is connected to Microsoft Teams. And as you can see, I have a folder that is called General and a few other documents. If we go into Microsoft Teams, you can see that I have my demo team site team with only the general channel. Let's go back to SharePoint and create a new folder. Click on new folder and give it a name. Click on create. And now the folder has been created. Let's add a document in it. Click on the folder, click on new and choose a document type. Give it a name. And let's go back to the folder. Now we have a document inside our sales reports folder. Let's switch over to Microsoft Teams and let's create a new channel with the exact same name as the folder. Click on the ellipsis and click on add channel. Give it a description if you want to and choose if you want this channel to be a favorite for the whole team. Once you're happy, click on add. And now that we have our new channel, let's go over the files tab. And you can see that it automatically picked up the folder that we created in SharePoint. So what would happen if from SharePoint, I was to delete this folder? Let's go back to SharePoint, go back to the documents library and delete the folder. Click on the ellipsis and click on delete. Are you sure you wanna delete this folder? Yes. Now the folder has been deleted. Let's go back to Microsoft Teams, refresh the page. And our folder is still there, but the file inside has been deleted. Let's have a look at what's happening from a SharePoint perspective. Let's refresh the page. And we can see that our sales reports folder is back. And inside, there's no more document. So because the channel is still active, then it will have a folder in SharePoint. And the last scenario would be what happens if I actually delete the channel itself. Let's go over to Microsoft Teams and delete the channel. Click on the ellipsis and delete this channel. Make sure that you understand what you're about to do and click on delete. Now the channel is gone. I will need to go back to SharePoint. Let's go back to the documents library and refresh the page. The folder is still there, but it's just a normal folder now. This is not linked to a channel in Microsoft Teams. <laughs>